Hey guys, Bearded Texan here, showing you another update video. This is the fifth month of the growing of my beard for one year. So thank you guys for staying tuned on my channel for these update videos. I love providing these videos and it's a great honor that you take the time to watch them. But as we all know, not every day is a good hair day. Not every day is an okay hair day. Some days there are bad hair days. And this is just one of those days. For the last week, I've been having one hell of a time keeping my beard in check. And let me tell you, it's a nightmare. Uh, I've tried balm, I've tried oil, I've tried wet washing it and drying it, trying to get it out. And I got one spot here that curls up and I just, man, it's a freaking nightmare. Um... And, you know, today I didn't do squat because I wanted you to see what it's like when you have a bad hair day. It's not all what is cracked up to be having a beard. It's not all a uh, good time. Sometimes it's a struggle. It's a lot of work maintaining this glory. And, uh, you know, we have to deal with the good and the bad. And today it's the bad. So how do you guys handle that when you're struck with a bad hair day? Whether it be on the top of your head or on your glorious mane. So for me, when it's on the top of my head, it's easy. Problem solved. But when it's your glorious mane that's the problem, you just have to soak it up. You just have to accept it. And you have to just own it. Uh, and that's okay. It's alright to have a beard that's rugged and rough sometimes. I mean, you do what you can, obviously, but it's hair. It's going to do what it wants to do for, to, for the most part anyways. I mean, you're not going to cover it in hairspray and get it all jacked up to try to mold what it, you want it to do. It's going to do what it wants to do. You can put some balm in there. You can put a little butter in there, whatever, and try you as you will. Some days you're just going to have a bad beard day. And I've learned to accept it, own it, and that's all right. So, just this is going to be just a quick video. As you can see here, We've got several photos on my journey up to today, you know, from week one or day one when I was just a bearded pup to one, two, three, four, and now five months of glor glorious growth. I love my beard. I love it. Absolute. And uh, I love my mustache. I love everything. Uh, my hair, however, has been giving me all kinds of fits lately. I'm having one hell of a time with getting it to do what I want. But, uh, you know, I found a solution for the time being. And I'm going to rock my solution. <laughs> this wet, nasty weather we're having in Texas. It's... Uh, it's unbelievable. We've had more rain in the last month than the last year combined. So I think last time I saw it, it was like nine and a half inches. Um, and that's a lot of water for this time of year, for any time of the year in Texas. So anyways, this is where we're at 
five months in, I'm almost halfway through the growing of my beard for one year. Um, next month, it will, no, November, will be six months. And then on December 9th, I have my first beard competition. So, wish me luck. Uh, obviously, my beard's not going to be very good as far as a competition goes. So, um, you know, five and a half months of growth isn't a lot to be competing in a beard competition. But that's all right. We're going to give it a shot. Because um, it's all about having a good time, meeting some other guys, and going from there. So... That's it, gentlemen. This is a quick update this week. I wanted to share with you my journey. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you coming back each and every video as we discuss all things beard related. Um, just remember, guys, it's not always going to do what you want, and that's okay. Rock it. Own it. It's your beard. It's you. Just embrace it. And don't shave it. The worst thing you can do when you have a beard that's arguing with you and letting you know it's a it's its own person is shave it off. Just own it. It's okay. You'll work through that bad time in your hair growth. I've had like three or four so far when it first started to come in. Um, and then it went through a time when it was wonderful. It was just wonderful. And then it went to a bad time. And then it was wonderful again. And now it's at a bad time again. So I don't know if that's just how it works. As it's growing in, it gets into these parts where it just wants to piss you off. Uh, but that's how it works for me. So if you're having that struggle, just embrace it, brother. Don't shave it. Embrace it. Keep growing that glorious mane. And... Enjoy the bearded lifestyle, my friend. So thank you guys again for watching my channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell button so you're notified when I do updates. Keep your eye out for my next update video. We're going to talk heroes and legends. And we're going to review the Outlaw Whiskey and Tobacco Beard Oil. So stay tuned for that. We'll catch you on the next video. Stay bearded.